positions now where you play against 1-3-1 one, one, and you have multiple forms of engage, but none of them are like... A but we should still expect to see Gotta wait for Chris. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll get ahead of myself, I know. But Betsy, he's not getting very far ahead right now at all. He has to pop both of his summoners to get away. Exhaust oh, on the Yanko. The Here comes Airwax. He gets well, popped up, but that health bar is melting. That's not happening right there. That's gonna be first blood. It goes to Ryu. They're looking for more. Man, he wanted to be the hero. Oh, I God. I heard the epic music playing as well, and then he just runs Oh! And they just killed him Auto attack. Man, this happened in a nutshell. Now it's time to siege going the other way. As you said, Yanko's getting caught, but he is going to be able to make it out. Tunnels, in comes the curtain call. Vander, he's body blocking, but Yanko's oh, all behind. There we go. Meganar, though, it's going to catch on to Vander, and he'll give his life for his jungler. A lot of people trying to sacrifice. I mean, Probably on the side. top side. It could be top side. All right. And Vander's getting knocked back in by Airwax here. Stopped by the Flourish. Goes through the journey. Very low. Bleeding, but it's not enough to take him out. Finally, he falls to the red buff. But Betsy, he might pay for that. Looks like Odawamne and Ryu chase him down. That's not going to be enough damage to finish anybody off. Curtain Call, though, is nailing Ryu. They've got the laser. Betsy's got the kill. They get two for zero. Because you want a team fight if you're Rocket, and especially... Hesitation. Oh, uh, oh, so late. Okay, not enough. Ulti Good. popped left and Good. right. Vander, though, he's going through the journey, but look at how low he is, Curtain Call. On the side, he's not looking to dive. The yank him back in. Oh, they get a catch oh. on Ryu, though. Exhaust. Look at his health bar. They take him out. Onslaught of Shadows charging in, forcing Yanko. He flashes, flashes but he flashes into the wall. Now he's trying to get away. Ray is on the back. Odawamne manages to finish him off with a transcendent. Five to six minutes ago. But they're doing it now, and then suddenly Airwax around mid lane. There goes the curtain call. One shot, two shot, three shot. Freeze is going to take all four, and the hook lands. Goodbye. And the fight's going to be started right now. Chaos Storm is on, but Raze is already taken out out of Wamne. His health bar, his evaporated rocket. They realize they can take the fight in Vander. Magical Journeys Ryu cannot catch his fight in time, and he's going to get sent right back. That's going to be found for him in just a few more moments. Steal back with a massive cleanup. Good pull. Oh, Tempered Fate. Oh, they dodge it out, and they turn their attention immediately over to Odawamne Airwax. He was taking up the front of this one, but he charges in, and they take him down anyways. That's going to be a double kill, I should say. Ryu and Odo going down. Betsy going huge. Oh, no, Curtain call. No, Freeze. No, it's it's just a magnet. A triple for the victor. Run, the run, run. Rang is going to teleport in, try and finish things off. Odo does grab a tower. Keep in mind, Odo's down to 50%. Vander is dead. Tempered fade onto Raze. Vander does go down. They're still on this Baron, but Yankos is around the side. Can he be the hero? They need him to be able to get the smite seal off. And now Rocket have peeled off. They're chasing on a freeze, but Ryu manages a shutdown onto Betsy. Rocket are in damage control mode. They find one with steel back. And now the fight has gone all kinds of chaos. Open up for the big Jin ulti. Will it be enough? Freeze body blocking. Yankos, I should say, is body blocking for him, and the Guardian Angel gets popped. This is actually going to be a very close and even fight, but Yankos and Freeze have way more health bars. Oh, wait for Silbai. If he tries to snipe with the W, in him in time, and then have a team battle. He was low. Yankos stopped the recall. Oh, and he flashes. Goes to the blue spike. This is massive right now. Steelback, the Maw of Malmorty is keeping him alive, and he pops his ghost plate, trying to him. run away. Here comes Yankos looking for the snipe. One more shot. He does it. That is so big. Is that Betsy getting caught? And they jump in, but Airwax, he jumps to try and push Yankos back. Betsy, the health bar, they're melting the boxes in, and they are getting put in a coffin right now. Airwax is trying to stop everything, but it's going to be not nearly enough. Double kill, triple kill, over to Freeze, and this is H2Ks. Everything started with Yankos catching out Steelback, doing the recall. He ultied back, found Steelback, took him down. Baron face to K now, and before that even, Odomne realized he was so, so fed on this Irelia, he was like, I can dive the Nobiter. It's back up, and there's minions on. They cut Yankos on a tower. That's going to be a two-man tempered fate. Jin in the back is going to have to stop his own ultimate. There's Chaos Storm onto Odomne. In the midst of all the Chaos, Inhibitor is going to fall. Yankos at the front of it, and Freeze will finish it off, and they get what they want. HGK turning their attention towards the bottom, and the siege continues. Yeah, Rocket's team composition did so well whenever it was H2K trying to engage on them. Can't, they can't move out in time. They'll be spotted all the way by H2K. That's Elder Drake into a Baron now. 
Steal the Baron and win the fight after. Kayenkos. Yeah. Not cool. going to be enough damage though. Look, he's even able to start this off and they can just take their attention off of Baron for a moment. HK immediately reacting. Tempered Fate will nail onto Betsy. Steal back in the back line. Does he have enough? But Airwax, he is going to have his GA popped real quick. And Parang is going to as well. Oduwamne trying to finish off Raze in the back and he might just do it. No, his GA as well. Everyone's got GAs in this fight. It's not even fair, but Parang and Airwax did fall, and the rest of H2K charging down the line. Freeze with the double kill. They move forward, and this is gonna be it. They might have gotten a shutdown onto Yankos. Odo might be dead, but Rocket have run out of members. They've run out of base. They've run Running out of time, out of and this is gonna be it. GG as H2K claw their way back after one real rough game. They prove that they still can tango with Rock at 44 and a half minutes in, and they take the game. What a close game, honestly. Even